I'm live. And I've got a package to open. I'm going to wait and see who comes to help me open my package. Hey, Steele, what's up with you? How you doing this afternoon? You first, you sure are. <laughs> I should have been on like about an hour ago. I'm so tired. I don't know what to do. I got off of work and went to the casino. They were giving away robes and I went and got the robe and the robe is like for a, a five-year-old. Hey, Daily Live, how are you? I appreciate you doing so. You're not doing much, just chilling at home. Hey, Bob, girl, how are you? You're light number two daily. I appreciate it. Bird, how you doing? Emmy. Hey, how you doing? Montgomery family, Breezy, Rachel, how you all doing? Welcome to the live stream. Nagaida Smith team. Tina Brown. How is everyone doing this evening? I'm blessed to be here among the land of the living. God is good all the time. Amen. Bob Girl says, I am like number three. I am fine. The guy that says, hey, hey. Emmy says, hello, everyone. Rachel says, hey, Shell. Breezy Nation says, hey, everyone. Daily Live says, I'm good. Thank you and you. Still Blue says, wife is making chicken foot soup. All right. <laughs> I haven't had that in like 30 something years. How old is my youngest child? 39? Probably about 39 years since I had chicken feet soup. Nagata, you know, is T-R-T-E. Oh, you sneaking. Okay. <laughs> Still Blue says, hey, Emmy. The guy says, that's good. You are doing well. Emmy says, big light, guys. Yep, thumbs up the room, guys. I appreciate it. Emmy says, hi, Still Blue Body. Still Blue says, wow, it's good. I know it's good. My girlfriend's dad used to make the chicken feet soup, but he would like them crunchy. And he would be like chewing on that gristle. I'm like, oh my God, it'd be like popping. TRTE, AKA Nagata, is laughing. Emmy says, you off today, still? Still says, hey, at Nagata. And it's actually TRTE sneaking in saying, hey, Emmy, you know my thumb up, got, gave it at the door. The Eli says, I'm going to sleep, guys. Good night for me. Okay, you have a good evening. Sleep well. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. That's the saying, right? Rachel says, Mary said hi. Oh, hey, Mary, how you doing? You still at work, uh, Rachel? What time is it? Not quite seven, huh? The guy that says, I can't eat the gristle. I mean, gristle is just, it's like, you know, like the same thing in your ears and in your nose. Still blue, I um, supported your channel. Show the love back. Support my channel. Yeah, we always have to say support, baby. The guy that says good night, daily steel blue says uh chicken comes off. Yeah, I guess you know by the time you suck on it and pull it, steel blue say I like it soft so the meat could just come off the chicken. Yep, I that's right. 
Rachel says yes. She's still at work. Hey, gorgeous. How are you? Hey, Alizé. Welcome. How are you? The guy that says bed bugs will tear you up. I've been attacked before. <laughs> Tina Brown says chicken feet. No way. Thumbs down. <laughs> You're doing good, Alizé. That is wonderful to hear. Gorgeous, JC, you're doing good. Just chilling after a long day at work. Gorgeous, JC says, how are you? I'm doing good. I just got in from the casino. Went to get a robe. It was looking all plush on the uh, invitation to come pick it up. And oh, my goodness. At least I didn't pay for it. I want a little bit. Not a lot, but a little bit. Detox Diva, hey, how are you? Hey, beautiful house, everyone in the chat doing? Alizé is uh, laughing out loud. Hey, Aquila, how are you? Nagata says, hey, Alizé, still blue body says, I support you at Montgomery family. Alizé says, hey. Gorgeous says, glad to hear you won a little bit. Yep, just a little bit because I hate to go down there and pay for the prizes that they give you to get you to come down there and play. I mean, it was packed too. Um, the guy that says, let me hold some of your winnings over there. <laughs> I'm going to stick it right in my grandson's birthday card. His birthday was on the, what, the 24th of April and I'm still holding the money. I'm like, oh boy, it's going to be gone in a minute. They have another good sale at uh, Michael's or Joanne's. Still Blue Body says, hey, Aquila. Montgomery Family Channel says, thank you. I support you back, smooches. All right. All right. That's what I'm talking about. So I got this package. Actually, um, yesterday and i was too tired the guy that says uh oh watch out now that's that's for your grandson yep i know i'm a, i'm gonna hold it for him because he in college and i know he could use that little bit of extra change so i'm gonna hold it for him you know i ain't never let him down still blue says you welcome at emma alizé um is smiling and laughing Yep, I had heard, um, uh, I know a lot of you know uh, PJ Phone Jones and that she sells body butters. And I work at the hospital and we have to wash our hands so much. Mhala 55 yes, you are new to my channel. Thank you for uh, coming and supporting the channel. Welcome. Everybody meet Mhala 55 the guy that says, I can tell you're a great grandma. Yeah, I love being a grandmother. The guy that says, hi, Aquila. Yeah, but what I was saying, we have to wash our hands so much. You know, wash going in, wash coming out. And then they want you to wash when I go pick up my patient and take them to the gym for therapy. When I get to the gym, then they want you to wash your hands again when you get to the gym with the patient. And a lot of it is like alcohol base. M Holla 55 says hello to everyone. And um, so I heard that uh, Phone Jones had these good body butters. So I went, um, she has a website uh, Emma says, hello, nice to have you. Still, Blue Body says, hello at M. Holla. M. Hall. Is it M. Hall or M. Holla? M. I think M. Holla, 55. Yeah, M. Holla. So I went on the website and took a look at some of the body um, uh, moisturizers and creams that uh, she carried. It's called uh, Body Loving Butters. And um, I just got the package yesterday and I said, I'm going to wait and um, unbox it, unbag it. 
in a during a live so we can all see what it is. What I do with my scissors. Nagata said, what's a good moisturizer? Because my hands are extra dry from so much washing. You know what? I like Nivea, but then when you wash your hands so much, it just, it washes off, you know. And so I really wanted something that was maybe a little bit thicker. And I want to say this might have like a combination of shea butter, coconut oil, something like that. It's like a mixture, I believe. Shea butter, cocoa butter, coconut oil, I think. I don't know. I probably need to open it and read what it says. So let me grab my scissors. Alize says, bye. See you later. I have to go. Okay, sweetheart. Thank you for stopping by. Love you. Love my YouTube family. Yes, I do. Bob Girl says, hello, Nagata Smith team. Tina Brown says, how many grandkids do you have? You look so young. I have uh, one from each of my two sons. Um, uh, the oldest is 19, and then the youngest is 12. She'll be 13 this year, and that's Breezy. She was in the room earlier. But then I'm a widow. My husband, he was a little bit older than me, and his children, um, his son has three, and his daughter has four. So those seven with my two makes a total of nine that I can claim, nine grandchildren. The goddess says, bye, Alizé. The goddess says, hey, Bob. Tina Brown says, I'm new to the channel. Yes, I noticed and I appreciate you for supporting the channel. Okay, so... I just unpackaged it out of the priority mail bag. Um, support me too. Hey, so, okay. So this is just pretty much my order. Um, I ordered a four ounce, uh, two four ounce containers of cream. One of them is called Hawaii, and the other one is called Maybe Baby. And they were $5 a piece and they were four ounces. Four ounces is quite a bit of oil or cream, I should say. Um, let me see. If your butters are soft, put them in the freezer to harden them. So the instructions are if the butter arrives too hard to put it in the refrigerator and kind of let it set up for a little bit a view is a view thumbs up number 15 hey how you doing pal welcome to the live m hollis says can't believe you are a great grandmother you look so young uh, I'm a grandmother but you know what I, I forgot I am a great grandmother because one of the my uh, stepdaughter her oldest child had a baby last last year so I do have a great grandson um let me see where did I leave off at Tina says hi the goddess sorry if I misspelled your name the goddess says it's okay Tina a viewers of you said, I'm good. I love your channel. Thank you so much. And the goddess says, hey, Sandy. Hi, Sandy. And the goddess says, hey, view. A view says, hey, Nagaida. Hey, Sandra. The soul food queen is here, everyone. How are you this evening? Welcome to the live. Sandy says, Grand, grandkids, Sandy says, hey, all, Nagata says, hi, soul food queen, what's cooking, huh? She knows she can do some cooking, and soul food queen says, she's doing good, still blue body says, hey, soul food, soul food queen, welcome. So this one that I'm holding, you see, this is a nice size jar. 
This one is the Maybe Baby Body Butter. And the ingredients are coconut, jojoba, and vitamin E. Those are the ingredients listed on the back. So I'm going to open this to see what it smells like. Because first thing I like is to see what things smell like. Mm, you know what? It smells like a, a newborn baby. Kind of smells like fresh, like baby powder a little bit. Maybe that's why they named it Maybe Baby. And that's what I'm just thinking. I don't know. And it seems uh, on the firmer side. And this is how it's picking up, just like um, uh, shea butter. But it's coconut and jojoba oil and vitamin E, but it's picking up if you see it on the tip of my finger, just like shea butter. And so I'm just going to rub a little bit on and I can see just from a little bit that it does have... Uh, some nice oils in it because I see the sheen on my on the back of my hand. I don't know if you can catch that sheen right there. So that's going to help because this is where I get really dry all through here. So I, I kind of like that. And it doesn't feel overly greasy. It does not feel sticky. And it makes my the back of my hand, it feels soft. And I just put just a little bit on. So I'm hopeful that as I use it on a daily basis, that maybe it'll kind of change, you know, the texture of my skin and not have it look so dry. The guy that says, yes, I can see it. Soul Food Queen says, looks like some good stuff. Yeah, I mean, there's a comparison. You can see that this side is a little bit more uh, shinier than over here. So you can kind of see the difference just with that small amount. Okay, so that's the Maybe Baby. It smells like a newborn baby. And this one is the Hawaii. So I'm going to see what this one smells like to me. Mmm. It smells like pineapple and coconut and it's uh it smells tropical. Pineapple, coconut, and I can't think of anything else off the top of my head, but just like a nice mixture of those, pineapple and coconut. I don't smell any citrus, just, you know, more tropical. And it's the same ingredients in this one, coconut oils, jojoba oil, and vitamin E oil. And I'm assuming that the formula is the same. It picks up the same, just like a shea butter. And so I'm going to rub this on the back of this hand. And it gives me the same uh, type of coverage. And it looks like a little bit goes a long way. If you can see that shine right there, right across my knuckle. And I just put that small amount on. So that's great. Cause even when I cook, I, you know, you wash your hands a lot. And of course you're gonna wash your hands a lot around patients. Let me go back up. Um, So, Soul Food Queen says, look like some good stuff. Soul Food Queen said, be happy to still. Um, Faith, how you doing? At Nagida says, Faithy Darling says, hi. Nagida says, hello, Montgomery family. 
Montgomery family. Emma says hello. A viewers of you says the scents are making me hungry. I know that's right. Pineapples, and it smells like pineapple and coconut. Um, hey Kimberly Rose, how are you? Faithy Darling says that pineapple coconut sounds good. Yeah, I like stuff like that. Pineapple coconut, and it smells almost like you could wear it for like a cologne in the summer, just something light. I, I'm really liking this Hawaii. I, from the name, I kind of knew I was going to like it. And the guy that says, or TRT says, I got you before I spoke to you, Faithy, and time someone showed love to people I share love with. It's automatic love shown from here. Still Blue Body says, smells good too. Yes, it does. Emma says, coconut and vitamin E. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. All together, that's a great combination. Both of those together, you cannot go wrong, uh, especially with the vitamin E. That's right. So Food Queen says, that is some good oils. A viewer's view says, supported you at Nagata. Emmy says, okay, my phone was really acting up, both of them, on the laptop now. Okay, Emmy, I was wondering. And the guy says, hey, Kimberly Rose. Hi, Ariane. How are you, baby? And the guy that says, I got you, view. Tina Brown says, and the guy that I uh, supported you and your family channel. We always say support, Tina. Uh, YouTube does not like that other word. Nagata says, hi, Ariane. M. Holla says, that one looks and sounds really good. It does. I, I like it. Steel Blue says, okay, Emmy, I was wondering what happened. Faithy Darling says, respect to Nagata. I always show love. Ariane, oh, shoot, wait a minute. Says, what's up, Nagata? Nagata says, Tina, you get love from us too. Sandra says, hello, view is a view. Emmy says, um, hello, Nagata and Faithy. Nagata says, hi, Emily. Hey, Andrew, ATJH Travels, just getting home, dropping by to say uh, hi to H Graceful. It's awesome. Smash that like button. It was very cool doing the Google Hangouts the other day. I enjoyed you too, Andrew. That was nice. I appreciate you teaching me how to, um, you know, share my screen on Google Hangouts. Uh, everybody show um, A T J H Travels, aka Andrew, some love. Um, he was in the live with me Sunday night with Pristine Space, and um, he's an awesome teacher and taught me some uh, Google Hangout stuff. So that was really cool of him. Real nice guy, real nice channel. You all check him out. Tina Brown says, love y'all. Got to get ready for work. Okay, baby. Thank you for coming. You're always welcome. I will be by your channel to check you out. And we appreciate you and, and we love you. We don't do anything but love on each other. Emmy says, still blue. It kept buffering. That has never happened to me. The goddess says, or TRT says, love Faithy. Faithy Darling TV says, hello, graceful. I hate when I... um. Let me see. Faithy says, hello at Emmy. Emmy says, Tina, have a blessed day at work. ATJH Travel says, you too, family. You are awesome. To be blessed. It's my life. Hey, how are you? Hello, beautiful people. Hi, age, graceful. How are you today? And the guy that says, Tina, have a great day at work, or T-R-T-E. Emma says, hello. Kimberly Rose says, hello. Faithy Darling says, I'll be back, guys. Hey, Jasmine, how are you? Welcome to the live. I was describing your, uh, your, uh, your uh, challenge. Jasmine, uh, 
where you did uh, Google Pick My Makeup. And so I just started it. I got part one done and I have to do the rest of it, but it's, it's going to be kind of funny. I thought that was cute. So I will be posting that hopefully by the weekend. I can get it finished up. Nagata says you can say Nagata. It will be our secret. Okay, TRTE. <laughs> Jasmine says, I love that challenge. I think it's pretty cool. I told everybody about it the last time I was on live. I just have to finish my video and then come back and present it and see who else wants to accept that challenge. Nagata says, hi, Jasmine. Jasmine says, it was so much fun. Soul Food Queen says, y'all have a happy Mother's Day Sunday. Much love. Bye-bye. Bye, Sandra. You take care and thank you for coming. Okay, guys. I got a bonus. So let's see what's in this bonus. Drum roll. The guy that says, happy Mother's Day to you, Soul Food Queen. Abuse Abuse says, I just supported you at Jasmine Beauty. Oh, my. Body Loving Butters, Mango Butter. Oh, I bet you this one smells good. Oh, it does. This one smells kind of fruity, too. And you guys know what a uh, fresh mango smells like. It smells just like the fruit. And I don't know how many ounces this little container is here. This is four. So this has to be at least half of that, maybe two ounces. I think that this is a beautiful bonus gift. And I got two. This one is... Um, Sun Kiss Body Butter. And it has all the same ingredients. So let's see what Sun Kiss smells like. The I, I know this sounds weird, but the first thing I got is Twizzlers. You know, that strawberry lic licorice. I'm smelling Twizzlers, <laughs> but I love Twizzlers, especially the strawberry ones. Not so much the cherry. It's fruity. I'm getting Twizzlers. I'm sorry. I'm just getting Twizzlers. I don't know if I want some Twizzlers or what, but I'm getting Twizzlers out of Sun Kiss. Hmm. And I'm sure that they're all the same formula. They just have different scents. But I'll probably will leave one of these on my desk. And it was just a little teeny bit right on the rim there from when I opened it. And I mean, just a smidgen. And that was enough to oil my whole thumb. And like I say, it's not like super greasy. I like that. This smells so good. Yep. PJ is sweet for sending this. I agree with you, Emmy. You like the smell of mango, too? Yep. You know, I'm not real big on fruity stuff. Um, not in colognes, but I, I will do like fruity, like in, uh, body butters and lotions, but my cologne, I like floral scents. Emmy says, I really love your pillows. Oh, thank you. I did a review on this, um, <laughs> set, um, Walmart. It's uh, what is it? Mainstays collection, except for this the blue one, but the gray did this blinged out one. I had a um, well, I have a blanket to match this, but it hurts, so I took 
I took it off sequins. They're pretty on the bed, but they hurt. They rough to uh, lay on. Still blue body says, I support you at Nagaida. Support me too. And thanks. Emmy says, I like body sprays. Emmy says, my favorite perfume is Coco Chanel. Still says, I support you at Jasmine. Support me too. And thanks. Yep, that's right. You guys can uh, love on each other and support one another. That's how we do around here in these parts. Yep, th these are nice. And I just want to say thank you, Fong Jones. You all go over and visit her immediately. And when you get a chance, check out her body loving butters. Um, all you have to do is ask her and she will give you the uh, the link to her website. Now, I'm pretty sure she wouldn't mind me later because um, I can go back and edit this live once I'm done and I can take the website from um, my email and I can add it. I'm sure I'm sure she wouldn't mind that at all. But I just want to say thank you for. Uh, the quick professional service and for the extra bonus bag. That I mean, I wasn't expecting this at all. That was really sweet. And I love you for it. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. I just cannot find nice pillows. I was surprised that they had this at Walmart. The it, Three pillows were in the bag with the uh, comforter. So I um, said, well, if I'll switch up, it's spring cleaning time. So that's what I did a couple of weeks ago. In fact, like I say, I um, reviewed it and it's on this channel if you want to check it out. Um, Jasmine says, I just followed you back at Steel. Steel says, thanks, Jazz. The Daily Showers. Hello, everyone. Hope y'all having an awesome day. How are you today? Thank you for coming to the live stream. I'm just here opening up some body butters I received today, uh, courtesy of Phone Jones, and it's called the Body Loving Butters. And they are loving my body right now, and I can't wait till tomorrow to see um, how these are going to work when I go to work. A viewers of you says, I just supported at Faithy Darling. The Daily Showers um, is laughing out loud. Yep, I, I really can't wait to find out how it's going to work because I have to wash my hands like an extreme amount of times uh, during the day. And um, after doing it close to 30 years, your hands, your skin just takes a beating. A view is a view supported at Steel Blue Body. Metrosonic, how you doing? Thought I'd stop by to say hello, age grateful. Hello to you. Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate you. Daily Shower says, hello, Steel. How are you? Yep. So this, I'm liking it. I'm, it feels like I'm still rubbing it in a little bit, just spreading it out, savoring it. Faith, he says, at a view, got you, baby. Still says, I'm fine. Thanks in yourself. A view says, hugs. Yep, this was really nice. Now I'm going to have to hide them from um, my son because he'll come and get my hair greased to oil up his legs and arms and stuff. I'm like, where my hair grease at? <laughs> so I know, but I don't know, maybe by it being a little bit fruity, he might not want to touch this now that I think about it. But I'm pleased with each and every one of these um, 
fragrances. I really am. Daily Shower says, don't forget to like this live show, Miss Great, and show Miss Grace for some love. Oh, thank you, Daily Showers. I appreciate you. Steel Blue says, I've been, uh, got you at a view as a view. So that means that he got you, I guess, a long time ago. All right. I've been got you. Faithy Darling says, at a view, respect, baby girl. Yep, so you all having a good evening so far. You got something good to eat for dinner. You got something lined up for TV tonight, something good to watch. I don't know, I might watch some reruns of Love and Hip Hop. I don't know, the fight went too fast and I didn't see who was popping who. All I, I saw that purse come across. And I don't see, I don't remember seeing too much after that, except for a bunch of people on the floor and a lot of hair getting pulled. I tell you, they are too funny. So I might have to catch up with that. Metro Sonic says, let's see, I posted a new video. I cooked dinner, pork chops, macaroni, Popeye, spinach, and now I'm just relaxing. I know that's right. You did a lot. That sounds like one of my days, especially if it's on the weekend. Still says, just getting ready for that chicken foot soup. All right. Now, how? what else do you put in the soup be, besides the chicken feet? Just onion, right? And some rice? Or do you use noodles? And maybe a little celery or something like that, because celery and uh, chicken flavor goes well together. Like I might put a little bit of celery when I boil my chicken for chicken and dumplings. So I'm assuming that you would probably make that the same way. Yep. Chicken foot. Chicken. I call it chicken feet. Chicken foot. It sounds like you only got one feet in there. One foot in there. <laughs> Yep, it does sound interesting, doesn't it? But I had a girlfriend, her dad made it every weekend. Still says pumpkin, chocha, yam, squash, scallion, Irish potato dumpling seasoning. Really? That's a lot. And carrots. That sounds like a stew instead of a, a soup with all that in it. Pumpkin, yams, squash, scallions, Irish potato dumplings, and seasoning and carrots. But it's good. It make you strong. I bet you it do. It do something. <laughs> Jamaican style. That's the difference. Okay. All right. I got you now. And everybody does have a different way of fixing it, depending on where they grew up and culturally. And Jamaican is going to fix it a little bit different. Metro Sonic says, Wowzer is very interesting. Steel says, my wife is Jamaican. Okay. I have a lot of friends that are Jamaican and um, I like uh, oxtail with dumplings and I like brown stew chicken. I like jerk chicken. And I, I do some curries a little bit too, but I like my curry in between how Jamaican make it and an Indian curry. Um, so it just depends on the seasonings that I use. Faithy Darling says, at Metro Sonic, got you. Steel Blue Body says, just to let you know, at age graceful, my wife is Faithy Darling. Oh, okay. I never knew that. Okay. 
You know what? And that's good to know. I would have never known if you didn't tell me. All right. So I got a couple on here. So it's quite a few couples that are on YouTube. All right. So I got Nagaida and TRTE. And I got you and uh, Faithy. Yes, I started her off with the YouTube thing, and then she just took off after that. Okay. All right. Well, that's good to know. Metrosonic says, appreciate it, Faithy Darling TV. I know that you're both nice people. You know, every time that you attend my live sessions, or if you make comments, it's nothing. It's been never been anything but supportive, and I appreciate that. Yep, Jamie and Diggs. I'm just thinking about the couples. Um, uh, PJ and the Beast. Still says, yes, we are very respectful. Faithy says, at Metrosonic, you are very welcome. Hey, Ann, you made it in time to hit the like button. All right, give me a high five, girl. How you doing? It's good to see you. How are you, sister? I'm good. I am doing well. Mr. G is doing fine. He's so glad it's warm outside. He out in the garage in the back. You know how they do it. Out in the open, getting some air in the breeze. He couldn't wait to get back out there. Thank you for asking. Still says, I support you at Metro Sonic. Support me too. Thanks. Ann says, tell him hi. I sure will, Ann. So have you been doing okay? Faithy Darling says, what's up at Ann? Got you, baby girl. It's so good to see you, Ann. I know it's been a minute since I've seen you, but I understand because it's, it's hard when you work. Emma says, he's not... Um, by yourself. I'm so happy here in St. Louis that it's warm outside. Thank God the weather out here has been nice in the 80s, high 80s. Oh, wow, Emma, that is nice. No, we just in like the mid 70s today, but it, it's better than, you know, Michigan is something else. Like it was very cold the other day. It had got warm one day like today. It was in the 70s, and the next day it was like in the 30s. It's like, wait, what happened? Metro Sonic says, well, I appreciate you too still. And says, yes, been working so much at Faithy Darling. And says, got you back. And Daily Shower says, I have to go. Just wanted to show you some love. Well, I appreciate you stopping in. I hope to see you again real soon. And what I usually do after my lives, um, I go back and I give support to everybody who came into the live. It takes me a little bit longer um, because I do work, but eventually I get back to everybody and check out some of your content or if I catch you in a live I just uh, pop in right quick and show you some love so I try to give back what people give to me daily shower says oh and I'm from St. Louis Emma says well hey neighbor St. Louis Missouri Faithy says, lots of love, baby girl, at Ann. Ann gives a big heart. Metro says, there is no need to rush. Please take your time. Ann says, I hate that I miss all the lives, but I'm in Cali, so it's hard with most. Okay, so you on, what is it? Is it um, 
Central time? Is it central or mountain time? Seven blessings. Hey, how are you? It's 426 out there. And it is seven, almost 730 here. So you three hours behind. And I'm just trying to think, are you central? To, oh, Pacific time. Okay. All right. Okay. Metro says 627 p.m. currently where I'm at. So you're an hour behind me. Daily Shower says I'm going live at 7 p.m. for my wife's birthday on Case Scratch King and Queen. Okay. All right. And says Pacific Central. <laughs> yeah, I got it all twisted. Emma says, signing off. Age graceful. Got to go. Working tonight. I will see you in your next video. Smooches. Smooches to you too, babe. You have a good evening and be safe. Seven is laughing. And says, I'm not sure, sis. I never really tripped. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm, I've been up since, what, a quarter to five. And what time is it now? 728. So I've already been up 12 hours. So like 13, I'm 14 hours up and going. So anything uh, is liable to happen. And says, but yeah, Pacific sounds the closest. Girl, I saw eight patients a day and go so much charting and my eyes feel like bricks on them. You know what? I'm not even done. I, I said, am I going to go live or go on and finish my notes? I did my discharge. I had one patient to discharge. So I got the discharge out the way because that takes a little bit longer. But then I got my daily therapy notes to do. So I completed one. So I still have two more to do when I go. Yep. I'm OT. Yep. Occupational therapy. So when I go tomorrow, I'm going to be two notes behind as soon as I get there. And I hate that. And I just can't do it right now. If Even if I fired up the computer and started to work on them, it would take me longer than than the time I would spend at work because I'm relaxed. I know I can look at the TV and, you know, take my mind off of it. I'm like, no, when I do these notes, I want to be uh, getting paid. Yes, I have been doing home health. I have uh, four starter care charts. Oh, wow. Yep, that's going to take you a long time because... You have to um, order all the uh, therapy and um, the aid and everything. And set everybody up and get the doctor in and check. It's like the nurse is always, to me, really the boss most of the doc than the doctor is. I mean, legally the doctor is, but. The nurse, I think, uh, runs the show more and has a better handle on what's going on with the patients. Seven says, well, I came to pay a quick hello. Have a nice day and night. You too, Seven. And thank you so much for coming. I appreciate you. And I hope to see you again really soon. You have a good night and a safe night. And says, I just hate the 24 pages. And she also says, yeah, they just signed their names. I know. And says, as seven blessings. Bye. Have a great night. Oh, I know. I did um, home health for a little while. I worked for one of my former students. She opened up her own um, home health company just you know to provide the occupational therapy metro says work sure seems like yesterday 
2004 to 2017 in retail, retired from Aunt and became my own boss, IT support 24 years and financial advisory 11 years. Oh, wow. Okay. You got an extensive and um, well-rounded uh, work history and resume in a lot of areas. And say it sounds like a lot of numbers involved. Oh, yeah. With the financial part. That's nice to be your own boss. Absolutely wonderful. My water was frozen. And I let it unthaw. I'm so thirsty. I'm trying to cut back on pop. And says, yeah, for sure. I would fire myself when, when I felt like staying home. <laughs> I know that's right. Metro says, been on the platform since 2006 during college years, class of 2009 with master certification of computer system support. I would love to have a little bit of a uh, background with like computers when certain things happen, but um, I don't know. I don't do so bad when things happen. You know, I'll kind of like search and uh, run scans to see what's going on because a couple of weeks ago, I uh, was going to be going live for one of my big mix and mingles, which I haven't done in a while, and it's about time for me to do one. And uh, Microsoft did an automatic update in the middle of the night. I didn't ask them to do it. This is something that they do on a regular. When I woke up the next morning, my driver for my Wi-Fi was gone. And they wouldn't help me get one back. Well, I went to Hewlett Packard customer support and they wouldn't help me. They wanted to charge me. And I'm like, well, you all did the update. Well, we didn't do it. Microsoft did it, but you all um, are partners. And that's not fair to me. I said, you all came in the middle of the night, did an automatic update on my computer. And when I woke up, my um, uh, Wi-Fi driver was gone. Oh, you know what? I just got to say this right quick. It's a couple of cards in here. They were at the bottom. I miss those, but these are just the body loving butters. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Contact us, and there's an email here. Uh, body loving butters at gmail.com and body loving butters ticktail.com. So I'm sure one of these, I believe, is the ticktail that I'm going to put in the description box so everybody can see where to get these fantastic products from. Um, wow, you up there, you got some hacking skills, Metro. And then Ann says, WTF. Metro says, sorry, no hacking, just a software maintenance type of guy. <laughs> And says, I was just joking. And says, you have to change that out of your settings. I probably will have to. Metro says, it's cool. And yep, so what I, they, I fussed with them for the longest and I ripped them when I went live. And um, what I ended up doing is I went to Intel. And Intel did a scan in like five minutes, told me what I needed, and they had a list of servers that I could get the driver software from. 
I downloaded it in like 10 to 15 minutes and ran it and I was I've been good ever since. So during my mix and mingle or live, whatever I had that evening, I thumbs up Intel and thumbs down Hewlett Packard. And I promise you, I would never buy another HP product, never again. And this computer is not even, it's just barely a year old. And it says, so it won't auto update. So they're updated, swiping computers out, very perplexing. Yeah, I mean, it took my, my Wi-Fi um, icon, I mean, in the driver. The icon was gone, the driver was gone, and a couple of things that are needed to make that particular driver work. And I was pissed. I didn't cuss the guy out. I held my tongue because, you know, you can get uh, more flies with honey. So I tried to stay cool. But after he kept, you know, with me, helped me, I was wishing I had to cuss him out. But I promised him that I was going to rip him. His name is William. I promised him every time I go live, anytime I do something on YouTube, I was going to call him out and HP out for the rest of the month. That was in April. So it's May now, a little bit over May. So it's it's been about a month. Where did it go? I wonder. Until your whole system was gone. Yep. Um, just the Wi-Fi. The only thing I could do, I had airplane mode. Out of anything to have, that's all I had was airplane mode. And I could stick the Ethernet cord in the computer straight from the modem. And um, that was the way that I had to get online to get the software that I needed. Yep, it, it's very weird to lose your driver for your Wi-Fi. And I didn't tell HP this, but it actually happened twice. You know, I want to help that day. And I didn't dare tell him that it happened before. And that from the HP customer service, they let me get it from them the first time, some kind of way. They let me get it. And then the second time it went and it did it, I couldn't get anything. And I'm like, well, what's going on? But it let me get it from the HP server. The first time it went out, but the second time, no go. And they wouldn't tell me where I could get it from, knowing that they could have told me. I'm like, I'm sure you could tell me where I can get this software from. Oh, we can help you if you pay $34.95 right now. We can help you, real, you know, really quick. And I'm like, no, I don't want to pay you anything. I didn't pay you to come in the middle of the night and update my computer. So I'm not paying for uh, these drivers to get back on here. So I just did it myself. Metro says more of a rip off what I am hearing. Exactly. If I if it happened before and I was able to put it back on myself. Why couldn't I do it again? It's because they wanted some money. Still says when you do things yourself, you get a better result. You're right. Yep. And I had to work that day. I went on to work and I explained <clears throat> to uh, the senior therapist that was there. I was like, look, I need to go. I said, I got some issues with my computer. It's the weekend. I'm going live. I need to get home and get my computer straight. And I had. I got a couple of other laptops, but I wanted this one and I wanted it to, you know, I wanted it to be right. So I did it. Metro says correct to steal statement and says sounds fishy, though. It, it is fishy. You know, it's like. And they hurried up and told me that uh, Microsoft was the one that does the updates, but they doing the updates to a computer that you sold me. HP got me to buy. I got the computer off of the home shopping network. 
um, for my 60th birthday. So it'll be two years old this coming December. And the warranty expired like last November. So since the warranty expired, they didn't want to do anything for me for free. But I, I, and I can understand that part. What I could not understand is that an update had been done and that my computer was functioning before the update was done. And now it wasn't. I couldn't get past that. And I think that they should have worked with me and they didn't. Metro says, I agree with your theory and still says it's the same for me. If I'm not uh, used to one thing, I want to stay, continue using that same thing. Yep. That's just how I am. You know, I just love this computer. Metro says it is most likely the manufacturer. I'm assuming. I don't know. And says, yeah, because it's almost like a hack asking for a ransom who the heck uh were they i know you know i purchased your product and you can't help me knowing i said i could see if i had like dropped a computer or i had done something on my end to cause that to happen but you all came in in the middle of the night with this update and took my drivers with you And says, shoot, got to go, sis. Dr. Colin, I've been waiting for this call. Okay, sweetie, I'll see you next time. Next, they would have asked for your credit card. Oh, yeah, they was going to ask for it, but that's one thing I don't play. I don't give nobody, you know, my uh, bank information or my credit cards. That doesn't happen. Hey, Felice, how are you? Welcome. Welcome to the live stream. You kind of missed the flurry of activity about 40 minutes ago. I opened up a, um, a package that I received um, courtesy of Fong Jones, some of her uh, body butters. And um, I opened them all. I smelled them all. I was satisfied with both the formula and the fragrance and... So I'm going to start using them tomorrow at work to combat my dry skin. Felice says, I'm good. How are you? I'm so glad I'm catching you live, even though I'm late. Oh, I'm glad too. And it's fine because people are in and out. Metro still here. Still, still Blue Body is still here, I believe. Anne had to go. She had been waiting for a return phone call. So... <clears throat> it is what it is. Everybody has some things to do. And I somebody had said that they were gonna go live um at 7 p.m. their time. Um I forget who it was though. It's not that many people that were in a different time zone. Police says, hey, Metro. Metro says, I always like to provide great solutions to the best of my knowledge as an IT support specialist. That's right. And that, you know, that's what you're supposed to do is to be supportive. And those people did not support me at all. They just wanted money. Police says, I planned on going live today, but I'm too tired. I was going to do this unpackaging because it's not a box. I was going to do it yesterday and yesterday was Monday. So you know how Mondays are. When I got home, I sat on the bed and I'm looking at the news and I'm like, I can't. I just can't. Oh, M. Halla is still here. I'm still here. Just not saying anything. Oh, okay. Well, I'm glad you're still here. And the guide or TRTE uh oh, message retracted, but they were still here some kind of way. I don't know if um, if he left out and then came back in. Metro says the anti-spyware I trust is Norton. 
keeps me up to date with and for me protection. I have Norton and it's free as um, part of my Xfinity or Comcast package. I got to go, hon. Family responsibilities calling. Okay, TRTE. Thank you for coming, Nagaida. <laughs> I appreciate you. Yep. Um, as long as you have your uh, your uh, cable and phone package, you have a great evening as well. I appreciate you. Love my YouTube fam. Um, then they give you the Norton uh, package absolutely free and you can um, protect every device in your home at no cost. So um, both of my laptops, um, I put the Norton on those and then my dad um, is letting me use my mother's laptop. And um, that's special to me. So um, I made sure the first thing I did when I popped it open is to protect it with the Norton. I have the Norton. Nagata says, likewise, we love you too. All right, smooches, you all take care. Thumbs up. Metro says, I have the Norton 360 since my senior year in college, full subscription at a decent price, renewal every two years. Okay. Because I know back in the day, um, my nephew, um, he would buy the Norton. And I think it was like about 60 bucks for the like CD-ROM that you put into the, uh, to your computer. Hey, Phone Jones, how are you? I just opened your package, dear. I'm loving these butters. This is my bonus package, and I have my uh, two four-ounce containers here of the body butters, and I tried them on, and they were wonderful. I can't wait uh, for tomorrow. I don't know which one I'm going to use, though. Metro says that's the exact one I had with the CD-ROM. Okay. Well, my nephew would get that. And when he buys it, I am glad you like them, hon. Yes, I do every one of those uh, formulas. They're all the same. They're smooth. They're not clumpy. And they smell good. I like the fragrance and the formula. So I appreciate that. And is it okay with you um, when I um, get done with this in the description box, I want to add um, your website because some people um, were asking about it. So I wanted to leave it in my description to contact you. If that's okay. Um, yeah, but Metro, like four people could use it that same uh, cold off of that Norton. Phone Jones says, yes, that's fine, thanks. Okay, I appreciate it. Yep, when I <clears throat> when it finishes processing, cause every time you do a live, it's like it takes two days for the uh, words to sync with the picture and all that, but I am gonna put it in the description uh, so that they can see it then. Metro says, Norton website will provide an upgrade and updates to keep your computer more safer than ever before. I know it's like, that's why I li really like it through my cable company, because it's like automatic and they do an automatic scan and tell me if it's any threats or Trojans that have tried to like get on my computer and everything always checks out and comes back good. And um, even with the um, update, it's never had any problems with like the updates. They always allow the updates to go forward. 
you know, because it's coming from a trusted source. Yeah, that is excellent. Glad to hear. Yep, it's coming from a trusted source. So Xfinity by way of, I mean, uh, Norton by way of Xfinity, you know, has been good to me all of these many years. I've never had a problem. Yep. I don't know if you're still there, PJ, but these things smell so good. And I don't even have on that much, and I can still smell it. So I'm not going to even have to wear my um my perfume or anything. I won't have to wear my perfume. I just um have this on, and this is enough uh scent. Because I still like smell it around me. You got to get in the candle business too with some of these scents. It's one thing I will absolutely spend some, absolutely spend some money on. This is a good candle. Oh, I love candles. Metro says, and also provide a browser protection. Also, if you're using Chrome or Explorer, I highly remember recommend Chrome. It's more safer that way. I do use Chrome. Von Jones says, if they get soft, just put them in the refrigerator. Yes, I read that it was some literature that came with it, and I read that on here. So that's exactly what I will do. Like in the warmer months, it might get softer. I'll do that. And that, uh, you thought about the candles? Oh, yes. Some, oh, yeah. They would smell so good to have, you know, matching candles like a romantic night you have on your body butter and then you light your candle that smells similar or contrast or compliments which you have on. It'd be nice in a candle. I had said I was going to learn how to make candles years ago and I never did. They got a lot of uh, videos on how to make candles. I guess it's relatively uh, easy. Metro says, sorry, my phone was ringing. Oh, that's okay. We all got lives. Things happen. Things happen. And yep, I enjoyed you guys. What time is it? It's, I like making wax melts. Oh, okay. Now I have um a couple of those holders, photo wax melts, um by Cincy. Have you ever heard of them? I bought um the wax melt holders for like every room in the house, and now they probably packed up somewhere um or in the linen closet somewhere. Okay, you have heard of them. Yep. Yeah, uh, and in fact, I still have a lot of the wax melts that I haven't even used up yet, but it's like only certain ones I liked. Um, one of them, it reminded me of a men's cologne and it was like a bluish green color. I forget the name of it, but that was absolutely my favorite. Whenever I put that wax melt in, it would last and it would just go through the entire house. Like some of them are super um, fragrant and it would go through your entire house, but some of them are not as fragrant and um, they might only, you maybe get a whiff of them. Mercury Fireball, how are you? Hello, welcome to the live stream. I'm just here talking to Metro Sonic and Phone Jones. We had a flurry of activity about an hour ago when I first went live as I was unpackaging because the uh, butters came in a package, not a box. So, but I absolutely love the butters. Mercury Fireball says, doing pretty good, getting ready for the gym. Okay. Um, that walk I went on, I actually ran on the phone, ran on phone. Really? Okay. 
Metro says, I will talk to you later. I got an incoming transmission. Okay, I enjoyed speaking to you. And we're going to talk more about your IT uh, skills. And you might be able to help me sometime. Mercury Fireball said, phone's the best. Yes. And phone says, hey, Mary. Okay. So you guys know each other. That makes it extra bad or extra special. Metro says, I'll be delighted to help you to the best of my knowledge. Okay. Well, I'm going to hold you to that. Bye. Take care. Thanks for coming. Because that was absolutely terrible that um, I probably have you on here from phone's channel. Okay. Probably so. More than likely so. Well, I appreciate seeing you and I appreciate you coming by. I always welcome new friends and supporters. That's a good thing when you network and meet new people and, you know, show them support from time to time. Yep. So like I said, I, I'm really loving these and I'm not going to have to wear anything except for this. Maybe a little bit of deodorant, but no cologne because I don't, I don't think it would mix well with wearing cologne. Just the butters will be enough by the time I do my legs and my arms. And if I'm still smelling the scent just from the little teeny bit that I put on, that I know when I, you know, or my whole body down, that it's going to smell very nice. All right, guys. Well, it is eight o'clock on my end. And before I know it, um... It's going to be time for me to get back up and get it popping again in the morning and see some more patients. So at this point, I think I'm going to call this live a quit. And I appreciate you guys coming and supporting me and coming to check out uh, these body loving butters because they're nice. I appreciate it. You guys have a good evening and a blessed evening and be safe. See you next time. Bye now.